Hi guys and welcome to the 13th pre-match press conference for FC Goa. Uh, today we have with us head coach Juan Fernando and Sheraton Fernandez. Uh, this is for the game uh, tomorrow we have against the Kerala Blasters. Uh, as always, the rules remain the same. Uh, if you have a question, do use the raise hand option and I will get back to you. Uh, this press conference is being streamed live on Facebook, but only the faces of the coach and the player will be shown. Uh, as is the custom, we'll take first questions for the player. So whoever whoever has questions for certain, please uh, raise your hands and I'll get to you. Hello, Juan. Yes, Marcus. Yeah, I I said it in the, uh, you have been one of the one of the most uh, most consistent player for FC Goa. You played almost all the matches except for one red card. You had gotten you missed. Uh, you've not played for the national team as well. Uh, judging by the performance of this season, are you hoping for a national call up? Are you hoping uh, that maybe Igor Stimak uh, is actually impressed with your performance? Uh, right now, I'm trying to give my best. I played all the matches right now, so I am. Whenever my team needs, I want to help my team. So I don't know about that. How coach is feeling? So as for me, I am doing my best, and I will always give my best for the team. Yeah. Whenever my team needs. Sirita, you know, you you met the national coach. Uh, he spoke to you last time. Uh, what was the advice that he gave you when you when you met him last time? Uh, what what did he tell yeah. you? Yeah, last time I met uh, Igor, yeah. so he told me to how to play and how to defend, how to go forward and all. So he told me everything. There are a lot of difficulties in there, in the square, a lot of like fighting for the place, for the right back. Absolutely. So you have to fight for the right back place. So I told him I will fight for my place and give my best in the national team. Are you happy with the way you have played so far this season? Yeah. Like almost I'm happy, but I will give my best. I want to improve my best. So I have to improve day by day in the practice season, in the match also. So I will give my best. I will focus on the next matches. Okay. Thank you and all the best for the matches. Thank you, sir. Marcus, and thank you, Sergeant. Uh, Mehul? Yeah, uh, hi, I'm Mehul from TV Sports. My question is for Sheraton. Uh, in the last four or five seasons, we've seen that uh, you are in the top four or five players in terms of tackling. And you've always spoken about how you enjoy a tackle. With this season, your tackling has gone way down. So is it a tactical thing, which, which even the coach can probably answer this? But um, why is that? So every coach has a different idea. Some coaches don't like. So I am not saying he is not he don't like, but I avoid my tackling because some referees uh, they may give penalty now. You know all about this poor refereeing and all. Yeah. So so I really avoid my tackling. Thank you, Sergeant. Uh, the floor is now open to questions for the coach as well. Uh, yes, mm, Marcus, please go ahead. Yeah, hi, coach. Uh, what is what is the mood within the team right now? Uh, you won against Jamshedpur, then you drew a very good game against ATK Mohan Bagan as well. Uh, is there a belief in the team that maybe not just the top four, maybe uh, FC Goa can challenge for the top two positions as well? Again, uh, for our target, you know, it's against Kerala. Uh, of course, uh, we. We want to to be in the in the first position. We want to be the, the win all time. But uh, uh, at the end, we are a new team. It's a new chapter, and uh, and for us, the very important, most important for us is uh, the focus in game by game. You know, because uh, when you have a good target in future, it's a lot of pressure. Better it's uh, to put focus against Kerala. After Kerala, we focus in the next game, step by step. You know, because. Uh, Sometimes it's very important to 
to control the, the emotions, to control the feelings. He, at the end, is the most important is only game by game. Thank you, coach. Uh, Mehul, you have a question for the coach? Yeah. Uh, coach, you have earned uh, 10 points from losing positions this season, which is more than half of your total points. We've seen comebacks, goals at the death. How much does that speak about the mentality of these uh, group of boys and how do you prepare for that? And the end is because uh, this season, uh, repeat, is, uh, is a new chapter. Uh, of course, uh, sometimes I'm thinking about the, the points we lose, but uh, for example, against Seitika, uh, in the third round, we lose three points, uh, in my opinion, because it was one penalty against Mumbai was in the last... At the end, when you lose points, is how you lose the points, you know? Uh, of course, it's necessary to improve uh, some details. It's necessary to improve... Uh, more the tactic, tactical points, but uh, okay, uh, <laughs> it's uh, our job, you know. But uh, I don't uh, like to to compare about the last season because it's totally different. Or we compare about the next season because uh, every season is it's different. I think the level this season is very hard level in ESL. Next is uh, big scores. Next is uh, a lot of it. Uh, Problems with tactical. Everybody, the, all the teams are seriously. Are the teams they are working hard? It's it's normal. So, uh, what about the mentality? Like even after going a goal down, this team, you know, they try to push forward and get a result of score late goals. It talks a lot about uh, their mentality as a group. It's uh, it's so easy. We are a team. We play 90 minutes. We are professional. At the end, this is. Uh, the football only life to, to, to fight in on the last uh, minute. If one player are in the pitch and not fighting until the last minute, uh, he knows uh, no play more in the first 11, no play more in the squad. Uh, <laughs> this is easy for, for us. Uh, everybody, when they uh, decide the, the, the squad or 20 players, when decide the first 11, when decide about the substitutions, they know the first step, the first point, the most important is uh, to fight in all the time. And then, of course, it's possible win, draw, or lose. But it's uh, most important for us is to fight it. Yeah, thank you, thank you, coach. Thank you, coach. Uh, Srivats. Yeah. Good afternoon, Srivats. I am from uh, FTWC. So, coach, uh, tomorrow your opponent KB uh, Kerala Blasters. They weren't. Uh, too good in the first round of the league, but uh, from last couple of matches, uh, they are performing more better. And uh, usually they possess a similar style, you can stay under uh, Kibu Vikunia. So how do you expect tomorrow's game to be? Yeah, in my opinion, tomorrow is a it's, it's very difficult game because um, Kerala, after uh, two games, was very good performance. Uh, then uh, the style, they try to play football. Uh, now there are uh, different plans, no only one plan. In first round, uh, Kerala uh, depends on one plan, but now have two plans. Uh, then uh, try to attack with the free spaces. Uh, they are fighting for the second balls. Uh, it will be difficult, uh, sure. Uh, but I hope it will be, will be a very good game, a great game, because uh, they have a very good squad. They have a very good players. Uh, they want to to play football, and, uh, and it's similar for us. It's it's. I think it's uh, the the next uh, Saturday will be a, a beautiful game. So, coach, uh, uh, last game Ishan Pandita came in and scored again. So, uh, what any reasons for it that uh, he isn't fitting in your starting eleven, or uh, any injury concerns again with him? All the time, repeat, uh, Ishan Pandita, Devendra, Samson, uh, they are young players. Uh, there are two options, or protect these players and to help them, or uh, maybe play two games and then it's, it's no, we need, Goa is a club who want to, to, to work with uh, young players, and uh, they need to improve a lot. Uh, they, the football is not the only one goal, it's only, there are a lot of points, uh, like a team. Uh, repeating high press when the movement is in press when we take another when we are in attacking position on attack control the space there are a lot of points and he's working these these points uh, he's improving but it's necessary to continue to help uh, if we decide play five ten or twenty minutes it's because it's the best for him 
uh, this is the first point. In the second point, we use the players when they're the best moment for 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 the team. Uh, this is the the truth. Uh, but for all the the the, the players, Vendra, Ivan, and Samson, this is our target also. So can I just uh, take another follow up question, please? Uh, okay, uh, but please make this quick. Yeah. Uh, so, coach, uh, yesterday we interacted with the developmental team coach Deggy. So, some of the players have been into the first team training with them. So, how do you think it's important for them to train with the first team, especially with foreign players? Of course, uh, it's very important. I'm watching all the the, the games of the research teams because uh, I I want to know all the the players about that academy. Uh, how is possible to help in the first team? How is possible the best moment to to will be with us? Uh, yeah, then when uh, they are here working with the first team uh, at the end, it's very important, of course, working with us yeah, to to learn about the the foreign players because uh, it's the future for Goa, it's the future for uh, Indian football. It's very important to learn a lot about the the Igor, Alberto, Edu. Ivan, James, because uh, they have a very good experience. It's very important to explain this experience for them. Thank, Thank you, Coach. Uh, Sandeep. Uh, hi, Coach. Uh, my question is about uh, two players, actually. Uh, one is Igor Angulo. Uh, he is not featured in the starting line of the last two games. Is it a tactical decision uh, by you playing uh, George Ortiz up front? And second is Navas. He is also not played, and you also signed a goalkeeper. So, what's the situation? About Navas, okay, everybody knows uh, his future is not in uh, is not in Goa. It's uh, one decision for for him. It's not uh, it's not necessary to talk uh, because it's everybody knows uh, about the uh, Igor. The first time, uh, repeat after the game uh, and Jan Hesport explained about uh, he was not feeling, he was uh, problems in stomachal. And then, then to change about the tactical details, he, the second game was the same. Uh, we continue in uh, some points in tactical. He feels better, but not totally 100% to, to help the team. And in this case, we decide about uh, we'll be in the bench. So we was in the bench. And if it's necessary to, to work with uh, Igor, uh, waiting his moment. Uh, now this week uh, he was training uh, all the days, good with physios, with uh, with fitness coach, with the team. This is uh, very important for us because all the players in the squad are very important for us. A follow up on this coach uh, Ortiz seems like a, probably one of the best foreigners in the league uh, altogether. So what does he add to your uh, philosophy? Because he's a good ball carrier, he runs a lot as well, defends and things. So. What does he as a player with? <laughs> okay, it's, uh, at the end, it's not necessary to run a lot. It's necessary to run <laughs> with the moment, the, 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 the best moment, you know. Uh, Ortiz, is, uh, he understands about methodology, he understands about philosophy, and uh, it's good because uh, he knows uh, the best moment to attack the free space, who is the best moment to, to, heal, to help the team in the building games, who is the best moment for to attack over the area of the wingers? This is good for us, of course. Uh, so happy because uh, he helps a lot uh, with the team. He helped a lot uh, in my in my opinion. But okay, uh, I think it's necessary to continue working because uh, sure he he can improve more uh, than the last uh, the last games. Thank you, Coach. Uh, Sandeep, uh, do you have any more questions? I'll lower your hand. No, no. Thank you. All the best, Thank uh, you. Anyone else has a question? Yes, Marcus, please go ahead. Uh, I have a question for Seritan. Seritan, you, you did not start uh, as, a, as a right back, in fact. Uh, you had to make a change in your position. Uh, so from a winger to a right back, uh, what are the changes that you need, needed to make? Uh, right now? No, no, no. Earlier. earlier from earlier to, uh, till now. Okay, when I was playing as a right right winger, so very coach uh, gave me chance to play as a right back. So that was, was in Churchill, right? Yeah, that was in Churchill. Okay. So, so I played very good game. Uh, at least I played uh, five or four matches 
as a right back position i played very well so on that time he told me how to play like how to do attack how to defend and all how to come middle so how to win the ball and all he told me that time very coach had guided me a lot that time in achanchal so still i am trying to do i feel i have to do more attack right now football is more on attacking football than of football every coach is like that if every if player attack at the right back so every coach is like so i have to try how to attack more i have to focus how to attack more on attacking football you almost scored in the last game so is that is that, is that on your mind sometimes maybe maybe you could score as well yeah obviously i have to score I, I, every match i have to give my best and before the match i always think i have to score i give my best every match i have thinking every match i have game plan okay thank you and all the best maybe maybe you could score tomorrow Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Thank you, Marcus. Thank you, Sergeant. Anyone else has a question? Please raise your hands. Or else, I'll bring this to a close. I don't see any more. I have a raised hand. It's Clinton. Yes, please go ahead. Uh, hi, my question is to Sergeant. Uh, Sergeant, uh, how do you rate your performance so far, and how do you take the match tomorrow against Kerala Blasters? Uh, so far i am giving my best uh, and kerala team is a very good team they play very good football they have very good players like so we have game plan the coach will do our game plan uh, we will do how to play and obviously we have to take the three points and we have to come for the top four Thank you so much, Ethan. Wish you all very best. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Uh, Srivats, you have one final question. Yeah, just want to ask uh, any injury concerns in the team or uh, any player who may miss the match. Uh, the moment, uh, more or less, every everybody is ready. We will be thinking about the last uh, training because uh, okay, some players has little problems, no big injuries. Yeah, at the end, we we decide with the the medical staff yeah thank you coach good luck for the game thank you coach uh, i don't is there any more questions it will be the last one if you want to ask i don't see anyone so i'll bring this press conference to an end thank you coach thank you seriton thank you everyone who has joined us today have a good day everyone thank you, thank you.